Test two. Testing. Check. <laughs> Thanks, Ed. Well, I guess we're going to get started here tonight. I'd like to thank everybody for coming out to the uh, 37th uh, annual Cortland Fun Day. Actually, that's pre-fun day for all the uh, people like John Carlson over there. Uh, what we're going to do tonight, uh, our event's called the Gong Show. Just tell you a little bit how this is going to work. I believe we have 15 acts tonight. Uh, all of our performers are going to get up here and do their routine. And our panelists, the judges over here, are going to judge the quality of the act. And if it isn't good, if it isn't good enough, you're going to hear a loud noise coming from over on this side over here. John, give us a demonstration, please. <laughs> uh, good one, John. I thought it sounded better than that, but that'll work. Anyway, I'd like to uh, introduce our panelists of judges over here. The guy swinging the big sledge over here is John Carlson. Thank you, John, for that demo. Next up, we have uh, Ed, the Sly Man Hurdick over here in the red. Third panelist, third judge over here. We all know Pinky over here. Keeping the community alive for years and years. Thanks, Kenny. On down the line here, we have Aaron Bruce. Be gentle, Aaron. You know, we all know how you can get it. Take it easy on him, please. And uh, I believe we're going to get on our way here. Uh, Fisher, go ahead. By the way, I'm the other co-host, co Jason Fisher. And I'm going to start it off. Thank you. My name is Ryan Anderson, by the way. About that, it's important. We'll be here Thank all you. night. Our first act, the Pike Valley Mini Camp. And this year's uh, participants, Kirsten Piercy. Wait, 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 wait till they're ready, okay? In a moment. This year's participants in the miniature camp, Kirsten Piercy, Ashley Thomas, Kira O'Dell, Brianna Long, Mara Ingleberg, Ashley Gross, Courtney Cox, Carly Swanson, Drew Southers, Danielle Rausch, Anita Robinson, Casey Clark, Morgan Eilers, Savannah Seedlin, Megan Swanson, Taylor Peters, Allison Dyke, and Nikki Weir. And your 2001-2002 Pike Valley High School cheerleaders are Megan Bauer, Nikki Davis, Amanda Hendrickson, Tasha Rainey, Aubrey Swanson, and Natasha Piercy. This year's sponsors are Janet Christian LeDuc and Renee Seedlin.
straight tens. There we go. Very nice job, ladies. Looked great. Should have seen it from over here. Heck of an angle. I think, yeah, I think, yeah, I think we got an act out of place here. I don't know what's going on. Yes, oh my gosh, it's the king, Elvis Presley, the king of rock and roll, folks. Travis Johnson, and she is Miss Nebraska Princess Spokesmodel and the granddaughter of Ken and Jean Peterson. She'll be performing her speech and talent that she competed with in the Omaha, Nebraska on July 7th and 8th. Taryn will represent Nebraska at the National Pageant in Florida. Let's have a big hand here. Again, all across the board. 
Okay. Our next act of the evening is Sheila Blanding singing Because You Love Me by Jody Messina.
telling the truth is a real big deal. I'm a person you can trust, and that's why you can count on me. When no one else is looking, and I could be a snake. Well, I don't even go there, because a snake is weak. If I make a promise, I want to break it, that's a crime. Say, have you heard when I give my word? I keep it every time. So don't forget that you must be a person we can trust. And remember, you can count on me. Thank you, Tara. Just a reminder also, uh, we have uh, some ticket sellers moving around the crowd out here, selling tickets for our 50-50 fundraiser. Uh, be on the lookout for them. They don't bite. So uh, if you would, uh, it's for to uh, recoup some costs for fun day and uh, help keep the fun days going down the road. So where are they at? Where are the ticket sellers at, by the way? Ed, pay attention, buddy. Tickets down here. Okay, the tickets are going around the audience, so uh, we could definitely use your support. Uh, up next, we have uh, a comedy act from a young gentleman by the name of Adam Cesarita. Let's hear it for Adam. Hi, everybody. I'm Adam Cesarita. I'm Betty Ingwall's grandson. Every year our family comes out to Portland, we gather up and do all the activities and our family always seems to be the strangest. We have my brother, he's the biggest, he talks in his sleep the most. One night after we watched a scary movie, he just starts crying in his sleep. I told him, Spencer, shut up! And he goes, I'm sorry. Goes back to sleep. But my mama, Sandy Sassarita, she used to be the one up here doing this routine. She was a little bigger then, though. She'd be walking back and forth, doing her routine, and she'd have to stop and catch her breath. <sighs> Man. It took a lot. But my mom always hates when I say F-words, you know. Everybody hates when you say F-words, right? She especially hates 40, fat, and finances. But uh, my grandma, you know, she always hates it when we waste food. Whenever we go out to a restaurant, we leave some behind. She'll take a napkin and roll it up and stick it in her purse. And then maybe a few days later, you see it pop up in your plane and say, Hey, I recognize that. But, uh, you know, I was going to do something about teenagers and cleaning their rooms. But y'all know there's nothing funny about that. One time my room got so bad we couldn't close the door to the apartment. You know, uh, I live just a few minutes from Las Vegas in uh, Boulder City. And I was driving through Vegas one time. See a hobo sitting on the corner and says, with a sign that says, I'm not an alcoholic anymore. I just need money. But have you ever noticed that there's some pretty stupid warnings on things you buy? Like uh, Duraflame logs, as a warning on it says, it says, caution, fire hazard. <laughs> and sunshades for your car says, do not drive vehicle with sunshade in place. Or uh, lawn chairs say, completely unfold to operate. But uh, I got three big signs tell you if you're a rookie at Cortland Fun Day. Sign number three, if you ask for directions, you are a rookie at Cortland Fun Day. <laughs> number two, if you worry there won't be enough food, you are a rookie at Cortland Fun Day. And the number one sign you're a rookie at Cortland Fun Day is, if you bring beer to Cortland Fun Day, you are a rookie. Thank you. Thank you, Adam. Uh, what I'd like to do right now is uh, tell you a little bit about the food going on, going on over here, coming up here. Uh, her name is uh, Julie Wendell. 
She is 13 years old and is the daughter of Bill and Marty Wendell of Beloit. She's been singing for about three years, and she sang at various events, including Beloit, Re Beloit uh, Relay for Life, Solomon Valley Hospice Benefit, and uh, many different county fairs. And most recently, you may have heard her at the uh, True Valley, I'm sorry, True Value Country Showdown. Uh, she also enjoys singing and playing the drums. Everybody, let's hear it for uh, Julie, Julie Wendell. still selling tickets for the 50-50. There she is right there, jumping up and down over there behind the golf cart. Uh, dollar ticket, uh, five dollars, you can get six tickets. Uh, we'll be having the drawing right before the last act of the talent show. Uh, proceeds going to the Cortland Fun Day Committee. Um, so uh, please uh, support Fun Day and uh, purchase as many tickets as you can. So let's see here. Uh, next act coming up. <laughs> We've got Little Ricky and his accordion accomplishments. Let's hear it, Little Ricky. Isn't that against the rules? You guys all don't know how uh, how privileged you are to be here tonight. <laughs> I played this back when I was 
I don't know, eight, nine, ten years old. And uh, I, I was going to be on Lawrence Well, but he never asked me. I can only remember about one little tune, and I can't remember too much of it. But seeing how I done bribed the judges with some of the finest hardcore cider, you know, in the country, maybe it'll help out. Here we go. Sing along if you want to. <laughs> for this year's fun day and thanks to all the committee members for organizing the Saturday activities and don't forget we got the Booster Club is still selling hamburgers and ice cold lemonade and we have the 50-50 raffle people walking around up there. Our next event, Amanda Henriksen singing 26 cents by the Wilkinsons. Oh. 
for your thoughts A quarter for the call And all of your mama's love Amanda Henriksen Wonderful job, Amanda All right, 50-50 raffle tickets, moving around the crowd. We need like to have everybody's support name drawn, and the other 50% will go to support Cortland Fun Day. I uh, have a few thank yous yet here. Uh, remember that Fun Day relies completely on volunteers from the community, and it couldn't happen without all the contributors and sponsors. So thank you for everybody who's uh, helped out getting this thing set up. Uh, also, a uh, special thanks to the Cortland Journal uh, for all the advertising for Fun Day. Uh, Colleen, thanks so much for your help. Um, also, uh, don't forget, festivities start tomorrow morning with the fun run at 7.30. Also... Jared Guile and uh, Aaron Alexander to perform for you right now, boys. Let's hear it.
Bell sound. Okay. Well, uh, don't you want to hear that? Uh, it's a 10 if you turn your head sideways. We're going to do one here that uh, me and my friend Trevor Burgess wrote. It's called Memory. Hey. Those days are 
fucking abusive there, Pinky. Didn't even give him a fighting chance on that one. All right. I'd also like to take a chance to uh, have an act. We have uh, Chelsea Engwall and Danielle Carter, who are going to be doing a gymnastics routine for us tonight. And we're going to let them get set up. And uh, Chelsea and Danielle are both from uh, Wichita. So let's have a round of applause for uh, Chelsea and Danielle. Tens again. It's a good thing I'm not up next and uh, not my cousin Ryan. Our next act of the evening, Sonny Ingwall singing a comical rendition to Sadie Sadie from the musical Funny Girl. That's Sadie Sadie, not Sadie Sadie as previously announced. <laughs> Savannah. 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 All right, while we're waiting, uh, again a reminder, hamburgers and ice cold lemonade over there.
Sadie, Sadie, married lady. With a ten year guarantee. upset over there. <laughs> that was your girlfriend, wasn't it? Yeah, I know. I know how it is with you. All right. Up next here. Whoa. Jason, you gave me the wrong directions to Cortland. For those of you that don't know, Jason and I have been seeing quite a bit of each other here lately. And he told me to go north about 18 miles to 6 miles west. Well, I'm bowing down him. From what I've heard of Colin Finney, be sure all of you come tomorrow. Because we're going to have fun. Jason says, down on the road, come here around the park. They've got a lot of games for you guys. So be sure you come down and participate. Thanks, Dag Lady. Is your family here? Oh, yeah, they are. I need to meet you later, wherever you're at. You've got a heck of a nice friend here. We've got a special announcement for later. Yeah, you can. You tell them. I was going to hold off, but you know, the holidays are coming. We can't wait for it. We'll see you all. Jason is the son of Mary Lou Nail Fisher. <laughs> Sorry, Mary Lou. No one's going to come back to haunt me. All right, up next we have the bag lady with the shopping cart. This next contestant found a fun day ad in a trash barrel on one of her searches. Being from a large city, she thought she'd try a small town to help her fill her quest. Let's hear it for the bag lady.
match chance for the 50-50 as well. The drawing is going to be immediately following this act. If anybody else still wants to get on the 50-50, it'll be right over here.
this a little bit dumber after witnessing that display. Thanks, guys. That's an incredible talent you got going on. Let's have another hand for that. Looks like that's the end of the show here. Uh, what we're going to do is... Thank you, ladies. Stick around. We've got two live bands this, uh, this evening. Tomorrow afternoon, five live bands starting at 12 o'clock in the afternoon until 12 o'clock in the evening. So we've got lots of great music lined up for you this year. Games all afternoon tomorrow. Thanks again for coming out. We'll see you tomorrow.